Your school, your news. This is LMTV, Linmar Television. Winner of eight Metro and State Awards for Broadcast Excellence. Linmar, your news starts now. Good morning, Linmar. It's Monday, December 3rd, 2007. And here's a look at the stories making news across your Linmar campus. Our top story. As LMTV weatherman Justin Cook predicted, the ice storm came and wiped out all the Saturday activities. Listen for rescheduling announcements from the office on the TV monitors throughout the building and right here on LMTV News. We have news of major scholarship opportunity this morning. LMTV's Rachel joins us with more information. Rachel? Seniors, how does ten to twenty thousand dollars for college sound to you? If you're interested in being no nominated for the to Toyota Community Scholars Program, drop off a scholarship to the counseling office. Your previous community service is a major factor in being selected for the scholarship. Deadline to turn in resumes is Friday, December fourteenth, two thousand seven. Jaina, back to you. Thanks, Rachel. Student Council will have a regular meeting Tuesday, eight fifteen a.m. or three fifteen p.m. in Mr. Amon's room. Please see Mr. Amon or Honey Sue if you have questions. We will be back with more LMTV news right after this. What are we going to do with all of these blankets? I don't know. I guess we'll just keep carrying them. Colder. What was that? I don't know. Colder. Warmer. Warmer. Hot. Donate to the Key Club Blanket Drive to keep the homeless toasty warm. It'll start November 16th and we'll have a box outside the library. Thanks a bunch! Welcome back. Miss Northwick's homeroom is collecting toys for the annual Toys for Tots campaign. Drop off your new unwrapped toys before or after school in the boxes in the four corners or with Miss Northwick in room 005. Now, Charles takes a look at the morning sports. Charles? On the scoreboard today, Limar Grills basketball took uh, Hempstead 73-29, to with the sophomores dominating with an 83-37. to Tonight in Limar sports, ninth grade girls basketball will play at Kennedy. JV girls basketball will host Prairie tonight, and JV boys basketball will host Iowa City West. In other sports news, <clears throat> attention all chess players. The first round of the chess tournament will start tomorrow at 7.45 in Mr. Kibbe's room, A104. If you have chess boards or clocks, please bring them in for the tournament. There is still time to sign up on the sheet outside Mr. Kibbe's room. Mrs. Pichet is still looking for people to help out at the boys' tournament this weekend. See her in room F159 across from the media center. And that's sports. Back to you. Thanks, Charles. In news from the counselors, is America's Most Wanted your favorite TV show? Law enforcement may be the career for you. Learn what it takes to become a corrections officer tomorrow morning at 8 a.m. in room I-015. Sign up today in the guidance office. A representative from the U.S. Air Force will be in the counseling office Wednesday morning at 10 a.m. Stop by for a visit. Attention juniors and seniors, Ms. Griswold is sending in the PSDO college class request to Kirkwood, Coe, and Mount Mercy. If you have turned in a form for a Kirkwood class and have not taken a Kirkwood class before, please complete an online application or they cannot register you for your class. You still have time to enroll, so see your counselor today. For more information on these stories, stop by the counselor's office today or check out their website. Now Lydia joins us with this morning's Arts and Clubs. Lydia? Thanks, Jaina. On the Limar Club scene. Contest speech participants, you must attend your scheduled rehearsals or let Mr. or Mrs. Fry know that you are not going to be there. There are a lot who missed last week. Your team is depending on you. If you are unclear about your rehearsal time, please see Mr. or Mrs. Fry today. Attention all thespian troop members. There is a meeting Friday after school at Mrs. Smith's room. They will be signing up for Secret Santas, so please attend. See Mrs. Smith if you cannot. All math team members, there is a mandatory meeting tomorrow at 7.45 a.m. If you are not able to see 
If you're not able to attend, see Ms. Northwick for more information. Jaina, that's your club update. Back to you. Thanks, Lydia. Now Charles takes your first look at lunch. Charles? It's the taco bar downstairs with refried beans and Mexicali rice, lettuce, tomato, and cheese. You also see side orders of applesauce and a ginger snap cookie. The other lines, including the food court, will offer hungry hobo sandwiches or a la carte items. That's lunch. Back to you. Thanks, Charles. That sounds really good. LMTV weatherman Justin Cook is calling for mostly sunny skies today with a high of 25. Tonight it will be cold with a low of 8 degrees. Tomorrow there's a slight chance of snow with a high of 27. And that wraps up today's edition of LMTV News. Remember, LMTV is always online. Just go to the high school website. For the entire cast and crew, thanks for watching. Make it a great day, Linmar.